Hi, Yoga Fit family, Shay here. I'm here to bring you some super exciting updates to all of our programming as we're going into the rest of this year and into next year. Of course, you guys know last year we celebrated our 25th anniversary of Yoga Fit. This year, the 10 years, a decade of Yoga Fit for Warriors, and it continues to grow. Yoga Fit overall has, you know, the best programming, bar none, with the most amazing trainers and even better students. Thank you for bringing all of our programs to life. Without it, it's meaningless, but you bring it to life. And I just love every time I get to have a workshop with each of you, get to see you at an MBF. Can't wait to the big old hugs coming up in Minneapolis and Scottsdale, but let's get right to the exciting news. I know you can't wait. I know you can't wait. Let's go to it. So I actually made a PowerPoint. You guys know that's the Air Force in me. We always got to make a PowerPoint. That'd be easier to follow along. Of course, if you ever have any questions, I want you to email me warrior at yogafit.com or we can set up a time to Zoom. I have a little link in my signature block. If you ever get an email from me, you can go into Calendly and just set up a 30 minute chat. I love to chat with everybody, help you along your way. If you have any questions about workshops or maybe pursuing the Warriors program or our therapy program. All right, the first announcement is the Yoga Alliance up-leveling rules are going into effect. It is finally happening. It's serious. The good news is Yoga Fit has been ahead of the game for a very long time. So the biggest changes are something we've already done. We did that. We made that change. And we encourage all of our trainers to become 500 ERYT, which you guys know we are. You also know we have, I don't know, I said 15 or so yoga therapists as well, who are also trainers. You get the best of the best. And of course, you get a broad um, perspective from all these different trainers, which I think makes us stronger as a company. So the first change is check. We've already done it. We're already there. So that's a good news story. Uh, the other changes that affect you are um, the first one is that remember for level one, there was this option that said you can retrain level one, right? Well, you can still retrain level one, but it'll be as an elective. We have to make warriors mandatory. And the reason is, is because Yoga Alliance is mandating that all 200 hour RYT schools teach vagal theory. What they're saying is everybody should be giving some kind of trauma informed information, or at least a perspective of the nervous system from a yoga view. How do we impact it? Um, learning to understand how powerful yoga is to affect the nervous system. You need to have kind of a understanding and basic understanding. You guys already do. If you already have had any of our workshops, you know we go into the nervous system, but vagal theory in particular, polyvagal theory is taught in our warriors program. So that's going to be mandatory. You're going to have to take that. Most of you are already choosing that option. So it's, we didn't think that was a big change, but if you have any concerns about it, reach out. If you've already taken your level one retrain, you're grandfathered in. It's fine. If you've taken level one and then chose a retrain till the end of the year by January 1st, if you have that done, you can be grandfathered into the old program. It's no big deal. That's not a big deal at all. All right. Um, and like I said, it doesn't mean you can't retrain level one. If you really want to do it, you certainly can. It would be used as your two days of electives. We are no longer mandating kids in prenatal. You still have to take seniors, right? That's really important. Chair yoga is exploding. It's my most popular class. I'm the most thing I'm requested to teach anywhere. So I'm just here to tell you, chair yoga is something we should all be really excited about teaching. And if not, get that manual out, dust it off, all right? But kids in prenatal re realize, not for everybody, we're gonna add some prenatal information for sure um, into our level one, level two, like the special concerns, health conditions. So you feel more confident if someone comes into your class pregnant, uh, but we're no longer making it mandatory. That way we can give you, um, push those into the elective. Since we're mandating warriors now, we wanna give you at least three days of electives. That can be any two days, right? Like a two day workshop in the warriors program, hint, hint, <laughs> or two days of like um, anything else, Ayurveda, that's fine. Then in a one day or three one days, you guys know we have some incredible one day workshops. So always your choice. Just know that these are the new changes going forward. Again, by January 1st of next year, that's a hard thing. So if you want to go ahead and do your level one retrain, you're like, no, I really want to do level one retrain. Now's the time to kind of plan to get that done before the end of the year. Again, if you have any questions, let me know. Okay, not super big, right? These are these are palatable. We got this. The biggest things are for the the, the schools who don't all have 500 ERYTs, right? Uh, so again, that we're not concerned about that. All right, moving forward. Oh, it's a lot on this, but this is the really big exciting news. I think so anyway. So the really big exciting news is that this is a brand new 
300 RYT. That's right, a 300 RYT with a complete trauma-informed focus. Um, so you can still do our classical 300 RYT, right? Absolutely, highly encourage it, fine. But now you have two different pathways if you wanna take on your journey. And this really helps facilitate, of course, those who are interested in the Warriors program, which of course we've seen an exponential growth, especially the last few years and online and with all the trauma in the world. Um, and so if you are interested and like, oh, I would really like to take Warriors and then a lot of the ones from the Warrior Kids and I have my eye on therapy, this probably is the best path for you because all of these workshops minus one or two are in the therapy program as well. So you're pursuing parallel tracks at the same time, kind of like getting, you know, a double major. I mean, you know, that's a loose analogy. All right, so let's go over this really quick. I want to keep this brief. Time is of the essence, right? We're all on a time schedule here. So the mandatory workshops, again, um, I want to point out that, or I should say, I want to point out if you've taken any of these mandatory workshops, you'll see why in a minute. In your 200 RYT, you can't double hit that because this is an RYT under Yoga Alliance. So that's the first one is Yoga Fit for Warriors PTSD. If you chose that, now, now it's an option. It's about to not be an option. Then that is going to be something you can't count as mandatory. You're going to have to increase electives over in this column. By the way, this is all on the website too, but I wanted you to see it on the slide. Okay, you have to take Warrior Kids Childhood Trauma. Again, that's both in the Warriors program and the Warrior Kids program. Of course, emotional and physical trauma, addiction recovery, restoring balance, balancing moods, chronic pain. That's a new one also in our Yoga Fit for Warriors 200 program. I'm about to go into that next. Of course, my favorite new one, intergenerational collective trauma, somatosensory, launched in Minneapolis. And I am jazzed about that. Oh my gosh, it is so intense in the best way possible. It's nitty gritty, down in the dirt, getting to it. And then ADD and autism. Okay, so those are the mandatory. Those should look familiar. Mm -hmm. A lot of the Warriors program stuff. So you will get your 200-hour Warriors as you're pursuing your 300 RYT. That's cool. Again, parallel tracks as well. Now over here, these are the electives. So uh, you would pick 10. If you didn't take any of these, say you did the level one reaching, you hadn't take Warriors yet, then you would only have to pick 10 days of these. But if you've already taken Warriors, which many of you had, then you'll have to take 12. If you chose like emotional and physical trauma as your elective in your 200, well, then now you're going to have to take 14. You see how this could, you know, uh, change depending on what you took in your 200. So just make sure you're not double dipping there. So expanding consciousness, positive psychology, yoga for the heart, diabetes, nervous system disorders, yoga for grief and loss, really awesome new one, yoga for sleep, brand new one coming out one day, caregivers one day, art of storytelling one day. Teen mental health, yeah, I'm a fave. One day, dream yoga, mm, it's a tough call because that's also my fave. You guys know I have all my favorite children on here. All of these are amazing workshops. Again, get you really strongly, almost to the finish line, by the way, towards your therapy program if you ever decide to pursue it. Okay, this is a whole new. So we give you a 500 RYT. Isn't that awesome? Very cool. I think it's awesome. All right, then, and this has been announced, but I wanted to go over it really quick as well. So, you know, we had a 100 hour program. We started that 10 years ago. We expanded to 140, and now we have a 200. The big change going forward, by the end of the year, we're going to phase out the 140. You can still pursue it this year if you're already going for it. Please do so. So we're just going to have the 100-hour and now the 200-hour. This is the 200-hour program. You still have to do level one, warriors, emotional and physical trauma, restoring balance. Then you got to take basically all the electives. <laughs> Mood balancing, addiction and recovery, chronic pain. That's one of the new ones, right? Intergenerational and collective trauma, also new. Somatosensory, really new. And where your kids childhood trauma. All right, hopefully that was fast and furious, but good information gets you what you need. If you have any questions, if you want to learn more, or you just want to talk to me, I love talking to you guys. Please reach out, warrioryogafit.com. Set up a meeting. It's also on our, our, um, our Yoga Fit website. If you scroll at the top, it'll say like schedule a call with a master trainer. That's me. I would love to see you. By the way, all those workshops are coming up. Minneapolis, um, end of May, beginning of June. Scottsdale in July. I will be there for both of those intergenerational collective trauma, somatosensory. But a lot of those other workshops, I think chronic pain is also offered there. I think expanding consciousness is also offered there. I'm sure several others that I'm just not remembering right now. And I can't, I hope to see you guys there. They're going to be amazing conferences. All right, friends. All I hope you have a wonderful rest of your day or whatever you're doing. And I know I will see some of you again very soon. Take care.